welcome to the Mutua Madrid Open. The fourth Masters 1000 of the year boasts the best lineup at any tournament so far. This definitely is one of the most popular tennis tournaments in the world. Thinking that I'm able to, to do a, a really good result here. For me, play here is always a, a huge thing. I love this tournament. I have some good memories from here. but Carlos Alcaraz makes it a 19th birthday to remember. Oh, it was brave. As Djokovic was already up the court there, so it had to be a good drop shot, and it was. As comfortable as you like, really, for Novak Djokovic. Cannot wait for this one. Rafael Nadal up against Carlos Alcaraz. He's found the line again. This is absolutely remarkable right now from Carlos Alcaraz. New moves, please. Alcaraz. The apprentice finally beats the master. What's just happened? You must be thinking now, if I can beat Rafa Nadal, I can beat Novak Djokovic in the semi-final. Of course, I will text Nadal Dian how, how he did it, but uh, well, I, I will fight and uh, let's see what happens. Sensational pass. Gracias. Stefanos Sitsipas makes a return to the Madrid semi finals. A high quality contest. Superb. And he's led the charge right from the start, Hazverev. The defending champion moves on in Madrid. The stage is set for the first career meeting between Carlos Alcaraz and the current world number one, Novak Djokovic. Superb. Djokovic, Djokovic responds. <laughs> Truly sensational. The man from Murphy steps up yet again. match Carlos Alcaraz becomes the youngest player to defeat a world number one in 17 years I'm thinking that I'm able to, to play against the best player in the world I beat, beat, the, beat them as well so uh, it makes me out of confidence third successive meeting in a semi-final for these two players Full credit to the Greek. He's 
He's been everywhere tonight. Alexander Zverev books his ticket to a third final here in Madrid. Now Alcaraz obviously has the home support, but as much your court as it is his. <laughs> it has been Rafa's court for the past 15 years, and it's going to be his court for the next 15 years. So um, I just hope I can give him some trouble, and I, I can hope I can uh, manage to win tomorrow. So Carlos Alcaraz looking to win his second Masters 1000. He will take on the defending champion here at the Caja Magica. Carlos Alcaraz, Alexander Zverev. Oh, that is beautifully done. He sends the home fans delirious. Sublime, it's a one-man party in the Spanish capital. Carlos Alcaraz is the champion in Madrid. The 19-year-old caps off the perfect week with a third top four win here in the Spanish capital. I believe in myself all the time. I always say that uh, I'm not going to play final, I, I'm going to win final. So I, I always think uh, about it and uh, yeah, you go for it. It's so special week for me. I mean, playing the, in Spain, uh, in France, such a, a, a great crowd, the uh, Spanish crowd, uh, playing against the best player in the world, uh, beating them. So for me, it's uh, a pretty good wish.